since I was very young, I heard sounds in my head, you know, and uh, I wanted to materialize those sounds one way or the other. You know, I always I have that thing that I call the love rule, which means that anything that applies to music applies to love and vice versa, and anything that doesn't apply to love doesn't apply to music and vice versa. I mean, to me, music and love are exactly the same thing. For example, some people ask me, what's your conception of music? What, what, what's your concept? And I'm like, would you ask somebody what's your conception of love and what's your concept in love? That would sound like a stupid question. And I'm like, that's exactly the same thing.
trying to teach my student, I'm like, you're not a player, you're a hearer of music. You hear music. And if you hear it properly, then it starts playing itself, you know. cheat on the music, never calculate, never tweak the music this way or this, the other to make it sound how it's supposed to sound or whatever, anything like that. I really try to always be as near as possible as uh, to my feelings, I guess. I think it's it's important to to be honest, not be honest only like sincere. Sincerity can be a dangerous thing, you know, sometimes. But to be honest in the sense that you know you feel yeah there is something you, you you should do and you really do it the best you can without you know cheating in any kind. That that's for me that's pretty much what what, what my, feel, my, my philosophy is, it's very simple, you know, really express my feeling through the instrument. Sometimes when the music is really going well, you feel that people have that common way of feeling it at the moment it happens. And I think it's a very simple thing at that moment. Here again I have a project for a solo recording and solo piano has become a very important thing in my life. I, I have always played solo, you know, like I said from a young age, but for some reason my solo playing, I didn't get satisfied by my solo playing until very recently, I would say maybe three or four years ago, where I really felt like something fell into place. I think I was really trying to play the piano all those years and suddenly I switched to making music. <laughs> 